I'm Lisa Foyles. Here's your weekly wrap-up of the UFC Minute. The UFC returns this Saturday with a hard-hitting matchup between Fabricio Verdum and Mark Hunt at UFC 180 for the Interim Heavyweight Championship. The UFC Minute will keep you updated on open workouts and weigh-ins for this event, so be sure to stay tuned for that. The UFC announced this past weekend that the organization will make a stop in Broomfield, Colorado on Valentine's Day of 2015. In a featherweight bout, 14th-ranked Max Holloway will look to extend his four-fight winning streak against veteran Cole Miller. Flyweight Zach Makovsky and Timothy Elliott will face off in a fight that could have title shot implications and submission specialist Ray Borg will take on Canadian standout Chris Kalaitis. The UFC light heavyweight number one contender spot is on the line when top-ranked Alexander Gustafsson faces off against heavy hitter Anthony Johnson on Saturday, January 24th in Stockholm, Sweden at the Tele2 Arena. Gustafsson lost a five-round decision to current light heavyweight champion John Jones but bounced back nicely with a dominant first-round knockout of Jimmy Manoa at Fight Night London in March. The Swede is eager to get another shot at the champ, but standing in his way is third-ranked light heavyweight Anthony Johnson. UFC legend Dan Henderson returns to the Octagon to face former Strikeforce champion Gegard Mousasi on January 24th in Stockholm, Sweden. In other fight news, women's bantamweight Misha Tate faces off against former title contender Sarah McMahon at UFC 183 Silva vs. Diaz. And finally, the UFC announced yesterday a bout between UFC legends Frank Mir and Antonio Bigfoot Silva at UFC 184 in Los Angeles. Top middleweights Yoel Romero and Jacare Souza are set to battle at UFC 184, a card that that already features two title fights. Romero and Souza, who have a combined 25 career finishes, hope a win earns them a shot at the winner of the main event, Chris Weidman versus Vitor Belfort. And I'll see you Monday for another installment of the UFC Minute.